hello friends welcome to the modern tech tip youtube channel uh, in this video i am going to show you how to add how to add or write the text on the chart or graph in the microsoft excel uh, before begin the video uh, if you haven't uh, subscribed my channel please do subscribe to see more video in the future uh, here first i uh, I already have the graph so uh, let's let's start with adding text so to add the text on the on the graph uh, all you have to do is first you have to select your first you have to select your graph and then uh, here you will see the format menu click on that format menu and uh, here you will see insert shapes so if you open that menu you will see lots of shapes that you can use in your chart so right now i am using the the text box so click on the text box and click on the the you click on the graph so here the the box will open and you can uh, type in your text so i just type the high uh, my text here so uh, you can drag and drop the box anywhere you want also if you want to uh, change the color or if you want to change the size of the text uh, you can uh, do by you can change your size of the text or you can change the diff uh, uh, the, the the font type so also you can uh, you can uh, fill the color that you can fill the box with different color so to do so click on the shape format first click on your uh, box then click on the shape format and uh, here click on the shape fill so here you can you have different color that you can fill on that box also you can uh, put the uh, different outline on your box so yeah different color you can use so i am using the red one so the the outline of the box will be red if you want to remove those click on the shape format again click no fill click no outline so those those will be removed so you can also rotate the text you can if you want to put the text in some angle you can rotate the text to do so click your click on the box and uh, here you will see the arrow the rotation arrow so the click on that arrow hold the hold your mouse and uh, you can rotate your you can rotate the text in whatever position you want so that's all about the text uh, now i'm going to show you how to oh uh, okay you can you can add as much as much uh, box as you want so if you want another text you can use the same way just click on your uh, click on the uh, chart click on the format and again you can you can put another box so that's where you can you can use as many box as you want now I'm, I'm gonna show you how to add the arrow so to add the arrow is the, is the, the similar process so you select the box you select your chart click on the format and uh, here you can uh, we have the simple lines line arrow and double line arrow so uh, now i'm going to use this line arrow so 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 now click click on the 
click on your uh, where, wanna, where you want to put your arrow and uh, hold the hold your mouse and uh, drag that line to whichever point whichever uh, where you want to put that arrow head so later you can uh, you can change the uh, the position of the arrow you can drag and drop the arrow wherever you want it you can make it short or make it long larger or short according to your needs so if you want if you want to change the color of the arrow click the arrow click on the shape format and uh, here you have uh, different uh, arrow color arrow size whichever color you want to use you can use different colors also if you want to change the the arrow cap you can here are lots of options to change the arrows cap arrows tail so I'm going to show you how to change the arrow cap so so double click on your chart it will open the format chart area so click the arrow click on the arrow the arrow gets selected and here you have different option to use so begin arrow begin arrow size begin arrow type end arrow type end arrow size so right now we have only one arrow it's it's the end arrow so we don't have any begin arrow we have only end arrow so so to change the arrow type you can we can change the arrow type there are different options or you can use this kind of arrows or you can use the round round down type or it's a, you can use the round type whichever size you want so there are lots of options so that's it for now thanks for watching my video if you have any questions you can write down in the comment box i will try to answer your questions thank you bye